The Swiss National Library German, Schweizerische National Bibliothek, French, Bibliothèque Nationale Suisse, Italian, Bibliotheca Nazionale Svizzerei is the National Library of Switzerland, part of the Federal Office of Culture. It is charged with collecting, cataloging and conserving information in all fields, disciplines, and media connected with Switzerland, as well as ensuring the widest possible accessibility and dissemination of such data. The Swiss National Library is intended to be open to all and, by the breadth and scope of its collection, aims to reflect the plurality and diversity of Swiss culture. It is a heritage site of national significance. The institution has been going through a period of change since 1990. This phase was given the name of Ramses, reorganization for an automated management system and enhanced services. The principal objective of this project was to modernize the structure and operation of the library and to increase services to borrowers and users with a view to transforming the library into an information center of truly national proportions. Topic: <laughs> Chronology 1894 – The Council of States and the National Council ratify the federal decision by which the Swiss National Library is founded, June 26 and 28. 1895 – The institution starts work on May 2 in a four-roomed apartment at No. 7 Christoffelgas in Bern. The collected works are opened to the public four years later in the Federal Archive Building. 1901 – The Swiss National Bibliography Bibliographisches Bulletin der Schweizerischen Landesbibliothek is published for the first time. 1911 – The federal law enacts the Swiss National Library. 1915 – The Swiss National Library and the Swiss publishers came to an agreement. The Swiss publishers offer the Swiss National Library a copy of each one of their publications. 1928 – The Swiss Union Catalogue is created. 1931 Move to the libraries present premises at No. 15 Hallwilstrasse. 1989 The National Library becomes part of the Federal Office of Culture Affairs. 1991 At the instigation of Friedrich Dürrenmatt, the Swiss Literary Archives are inaugurated. 1992 The Parliament votes the new law on the Swiss National Library. 1993 VTLS Library Management Software is introduced. 1994 – Access to Helveticat, the automated catalogue, goes public. 1995 – Swiss ISSN Centre is opened. The same year the Swiss National Library takes part in the foundation of MEMORIAV, the Association for the Preservation of the Audiovisual Heritage of Switzerland. 1996 – The Swiss Posters Catalogue CCSA, Catalogue Collectif des Affiches Suisses goes online. 1997 Inauguration of the Underground Stacks East 2000 Inauguration of the Center Dürrenmatt Nucatel 2001 The Swiss National Library returns to its premises which had been considerably renovated and enlarged. 2003 Swiss Infodesk, a commented list of relevant links about Swiss topics, goes online. 2005 – The Swiss National Library launches the project Virtual Information about Switzerland, a partnership between libraries. The participating libraries transfer the reader's demands to the library which is specialized in the field. 2006 – The Swiss National Library is run according to the principles of new public management. 2009 – Inauguration of the Underground Stacks West 2011 – The Swiss Literary Archives begin collecting in a new area and acquire their first publisher's archive, that of Peter Schifferly's Archie Verlag. 2011 – The e-Helvetica electronic collections are accessible for research. 2012 – Strategy 2012-2019 – The future is digital. But paper remains. See also Staatsarchiv Zurich Swiss Book Swiss Federal Archives <laughs>